Mark Pawsey. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Yeah. Um, a year ago, the Bay Select Committee visited the Honda <coughs> plant at Swindon and we saw Civics coming off the line, many destined for the European market, and we saw the, very substantial, the benefits of the very substantial overseas investment that's taken place in our auto industry, some of which has been uh, to the benefit of my constituency through the London Electric Vehicle Company, uh, and the investment which reached in its peak year of 2013 588 million pounds. Um, are there any decisions that the Secretary of State would suggest this House might take in the next few days which would encourage future investment to get back to those kind of levels? I would agree. The, the, the context of technological change uh, is something that is common to the motor industry uh, around the world. Uh, but as I, I hope have been clear, we have the opportunity uh, to be a beneficiary. Uh, of that change. Uh, and because we can't be complacent at how competitive the sector is around the world, we must do everything we can to give confidence uh, to investors. Uh, and that certainly involves, uh, over the next few days, uh, agreeing a deal that then can uh, unleash, uh, I think, the, uh, the optimism that comes from uh, investment up and down the country that uh, I know uh, in many instances, uh, is not taking place uh, while people contemplate uh, what our future trading relationship will be.